good. Okay, all right. Yep. Hey guys, being a separate fans here, finally back at the layout once again. Um, and yeah, we were just uh, we just got here like an hour ago, and we we're just planning on um, like our game plan, what we're gonna do, and laying out some track plans. So you want to talk about? Yeah, yeah, sure. This so, section. Uh, yeah, so we're doing like a couple things on uh, our little break this time. Um, so we'll be up here for about a week. I think we talked about that in the last video, but. Uh, right out here, and if you look at the last video as well, there should be basically the the plan is laid out in terms of um, what track work we're going to do, as well as we have an extension coming up. But in here, uh, there's going to be some industrial changes. Uh, you can see roughly laid out one of the you know sections of the track that we're going to add in. So originally we just had those two spurs over there, and those were going to be the propane facility as well as a, another industry and then we have the grain elevator there as well as a warehouse um, but some changes are coming you can see Ryan's laid out the turnouts here as they are going to go so we'll have a, a tail track uh, pop out this way there will be a little um, this will be sort of a run around section there we don't have that one section of uh, flex track in there but that'll go there and then Possibly too, right? We're gonna extend one of these yeah, spur tracks into this, this bowl here. Yeah, this part of this track is gonna get extended probably to like somewhere around here. Yeah. Like curve a little bit. Cause this track's gonna be gone. Not gone, there's still gonna be something here, but it's gonna be moved out a little bit. So we kinda have to see where the track lays out before we plan in, in here. But yeah, yeah. Yeah. There's gonna be at least, I think, three more rail served industries in this location. Yeah. If not more. We'll see as we kinda fit stuff in. Certainly. Uh, there's definitely enough space for it, because right now we, you know, there's all these turnouts laid out here. So these are all going to be used either in this area here, uh, or, well, we'll use a lot of them too on the extension, which we'll talk about, but um, I guess you did an unboxing video? Yeah, or? I don't know. We might throw the clip into this video or have a separate video. We don't really know what we're going to do yet, but this is pretty much all the stuff that I went over in the unboxing the yeah. switches. Um, two more Digitrax panels for throttle control, um, some reversing modules, and then there's a bunch of track behind you in this box. Um, I don't know if you guys want to see that. Flex track? Yep, flex track, and then cork. So let's finish it. Yeah. Um, um, yeah. Uh, so yeah, I don't know, this is just a quick video kind of to show the layout in its current form before we kind of start ripping stuff up and adding stuff in yeah um and we might actually add some clips i don't know when this video is going to end it's either going to end here or we're going to add some stuff of us working or any progress we make yeah in the same video i don't know we'll see we're just working on the fly so uh, yeah i guess uh you will see the final product but uh anyway um yeah so should we walk through really quick the where extension? the extension's going yeah go? sure yeah yeah if you want to do that so and then also like what tracks are going to come out right so like yeah. this curve down here yeah. you mentioned that but Alright, okay, so do you want me to go over that? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so the extension, we already talked about this, but now you guys are in the actual room. So uh, the track, the main line is going to extend across this open area. There's going to be a lift bridge in here, and then run along this back wall all the way around. And then there's a little indent in the wall over there, and it's going to curve, go into that little separate room, and then curve around the wall, and and somewhere along that back wall to the right of that oil tank. Yeah, somewhere out here. In there, yeah, we'll have the uh, reverse loop. So yeah, that should, we did the math and it should add probably a good, at least 70 feet to the main line room. Yeah. And yeah, that'd be pretty cool. So yeah, that'll stretch all the way along the walls. And that is the big thing that we're working on this week. But um, of course we also have these industries to do. So I don't yeah. think, we don't have like kits in, for buildings and stuff in here, but we're gonna get the, track laid out as we want it to. Actually, I think we have one. Hold oh, on. really? Yeah. Well, uh, that would be cool, so. Oh, shit, right here. What? Oh! Yeah, I forgot we had oh, that my. right yeah, now. Oh, my. Yeah, I forgot we had that. That's probably going to be that's a bitch to put together. Building. But, yeah, that'll definitely go in there Oh, somewhere. man. Okay, well, that's good news. Yeah. And uh, elsewhere on the layout? I don't know. There's really not much else to update on. just want to, like, do a recap, because I think this is the first video of both of us actually at the layout in, like, three plus years right? yeah for sure it's crazy how long it's been um not much has changed yeah pretty much all if you go back to our old videos we went through the process of pretty much putting all this together 
over here, there's not much that needs to be done. Just touching up some scenery, and I'm pretty sure like all of these light poles need to get fixed because yeah, the lights are probably all burned out. But yeah, we'll probably straighten them out when we put them back. In oh the yeah, they're all, yeah. they're all bent over. But yeah, no, it's looking good. So this is the layout, and um, yeah, we're gonna get to work right now. So cool. Yeah.